Good morning, everyone. I am Mark Joshua Guy. And I am Mike Angelo Gear. And, and today, today we're we are going, going to Germany. Germany. So, Germany is a country that has a diverse culture and influence around the world. Though the country may not be as large or powerful as other countries like the United States, however, Germany's economy is powerful and is considered the strongest economy in all of Europe. In this video, we will discuss how Germany's media and cultural influence has held worldwide through their food, cultural, media, and pop culture influences that are widely popularized across borders. So first, let me ask Mike to give us a head start to, to our trip to Germany. Hey everyone, so right now, I will talking about Germany's food culture. So here are the three German foods that took part in influencing the other parts of the world. We have the pretzels. In today's era, pretzels have become a popular food that has been colliding with other food cultures like having pretzels with ice cream or having it as a churro. But the origins of famous pretzels is from none other than Germany. It has originated in the southern part of Germany and was originally called as pretzels in the early 1861. The hard pretzels had its beginnings in Pennsylvania. One story explains that the pretzel was first invented when one of the baker's apprentices dozed up while baking swift pretzels. Next, we have the Black Forest Gateau. The sweet chocolate cake we know as Black Forest Cake was originally from Germany, known as the Black Forest Gateau. It was first made by baker Josef Keller, who first decided to combine cream, cherries, and schnapps in a cake which delighted people all around the world. And why was it called Black Forest Gateau? The dessert is not directly named after the Black Forest mountain range in southern western Germany. According to one school of thought, the name is derived from the specialty liquor of that region known as Schwarzwälder Kirsche, which is distilled from tart cherries. And for the last item we have right now, we have none other than sausage. There's no Germany without sausage, they say. As sausage began as a means of survival for Germans during the winter months, the best cured sausages came from mountainous regions where the dry northern winds help in the curing process. There are countries cured, smoke, and other varieties available across worst loving Germany. So, for the list, we will focus on some of the best German street food, fried sausages. There are more than 40 varieties of German browers, fried on a barbecue or in a pan, and then served in a white bread roll with mustard on the go, or with potato salad, as the perfect accompaniment for German beer. Germany has influenced the world in such a way that we find this type of food common in our country, but in fact, some of them has originated from Germany. So moving on to the interesting fact about Germany, which is to be shared with by Guy. Hello everyone, and once again, I am Mark Joshua Guy, and I will be talking about the things that Germany has influenced over other parts of the world. Did you ever wonder where Santa Claus of Christmas Day came from? How about we dig deeper into this topic? Santa Claus. One of the symbols of Christmas Eve was actually first visualized by a German cartoonist named Thomas Nast. Thomas Nast is actually a German-American cartoonist that was born in Landau, Bavaria, Germany. Thomas Nast didn't actually invent the American Christmas we know of today, but he made the visualization of the modern-day Santa Claus that all the people love. As of today, all the people who celebrate Christmas all see and believe in the Santa Claus Thomas Nast has created. To follow up our topic of Santa Claus and Christmas, next we have the adorable gingerbread houses. The concept of gingerbread houses was first developed or originated in Germany during the 16th century. The elaborate cookie-walled houses, decorated with foil in addition to gold leaf, became highly associated with Christmas tradition. 
as the gingerbread houses was endured to the other parts of the world through the story of Hansel and Gretel that was written by Jacob and Wilhelm Grimm, who were both born in Germany. Thinking back to where some foods, behaviors, and traditions originated, there were quite a lot of them that were influenced by Germany, you know. For example, the Christmas tradition that was highly influenced by Germany as if it was themed by them. So I think that's all for today, folks. Goodbye, everybody, and thank you for watching.